so my first video about the number one YouTuber has been getting a lot of comments lately. You get a lot of nice ones, but then you also get the incredibly imbecilic ones. I mean, some of them are so profoundly idiotic that I just couldn't help but screen cap a whole bunch of them and dedicate an entire video to it. So what I've done is split it into three subsections, the first one being broken logic comments, the second being spelling and grammar morons, and the third being threats and insults. So seeing as it's first, I might as well start with broken logic. So Jonathan, uh, he's been commenting on you know, the video quite a few times. He's particularly been personally insulted by the video for some reason. Not sure why, but this is his comment. This is why you have even, you don't even have a decent subs because you hate on e regular, I guess, human. On a regular human that has a successful life. Well, that's totally untrue for a start. I'm extremely happy with the amount of subscribers I have in the time that I've owned this channel, so it's one tick away from that. And, okay, he's a regular human, but that, that's not why I decided to make the video in the first place. The whole point, I don't I don't think he even watched the video. What I think a lot of these people are doing is they just, they're like, huh, man, you know what? I really like PewDiePie. You know, he's like my favorite YouTuber, so you know what I'm going to do? Instead of going on his channel and watching his videos, I'm going to type into YouTube, I hate PewDiePie, to see, so, to have a look at the people that do hate him, so then I can go on their their videos, dislike them, and write a comment without even watching and seeing what they want, e even though the, the video clearly indicates what they're going to be talking about, and the whole point of it is to describe their feelings on the, on the, the YouTube, the number one YouTuber, so I don't know what you want, Jonathan, but getting off YouTube and, I don't know, going for a bike ride will probably help clear your head. Okay, that was like one comment, and I just talked for pretty much an entire minute straight, so this is probably going to be quite a long one. Stick with me here. So this guy says, why don't you show your face? If you have a problem with PewDiePie, then shut up and sleep. And then he commented again saying, show your face, noob. I don't know, I don't I have no idea what showing my face would even do to help proving even anything. It's not relevant even in the slightest to anything I was trying to say. I think what these people do is they come in and they try and compare everything you do to what PewDiePie does. See, he, he shows his face in all of his, all of his videos and things, and somehow that, in their mind, makes it relevant to my video. I, it, it would prove nothing mal maladden, and I'm not going to do it, so go away. Okay, this one is mind-numbing. We defend him because he does nothing to you. If you don't like him, fine, but keep your opinion to yourself. That is just some of the most flawed logic I've, I've ever heard. So basically what you're saying is, you can't criticise him. Why not? You criticise movies or music or anything. Why can't you criticise this one guy? Because his fans will just attack you? No. I mean, I can, I can say whatever the hell I want about him because it's my opinion. And whatever. It shouldn't, it shouldn't take anything away from it for you. And if it does, then you really got to reevaluate some things that you're doing with your f***ing life. Don't make these videos and you won't get hate, asshole, and it's P-U-E-D-I-P-I. I don't give a shit how you pronounce his name, to be honest. It's not a real word, and it's not exactly at the top of my list of important things to pronounce correctly, so... No. Also, I I'm gonna keep making videos about what I want to make them about. If I feel that way, I'm not going to be scared of the fan base to the point where I'm not going to upload a video and just... Oh, I'm gonna just hide in the corner and just say to myself... Oh yeah, PewDiePie, PewDiePie is so scary. Oh, oh, I don't want to make a video about all of his fans because oh, they'll get so mad. No, I don't care. I mean, seriously, all you're doing is proving the point that I made in the video and whatever. If you hate PewDiePie, does not me you have to tell everyone you're just jealous. Sorry, I was not trying to be mean. Calling me jealous is is kind of being mean. So you are being mean. Sorry to Sorry to reveal that to you, but you are. And I'm not jealous. That's another one of the PewDiePie mega fan things of like, oh, you don't like him because you're jealous of him. Okay, you're gonna be jealous of, say, anyone of his sort of status. He's the number one YouTuber. You know, in the same way you're jealous of Brad Pitt for being rich or whatever, or famous, you know? It works in the same way. How do you know bros are stupid? <laughs> Just f*** you. F*** you. If you're not going to watch my video and, and even, you know, look into it at all, just f*** off, seriously. Just just leave. Oh my god, this one. I think you're just one of these kinds of pluplur 
but hate and try to be a smartass and a tough guy to make people think you know better when you actually are just an another wannabe and it's tr truly funny you rely on YouTube to pay your bills and cause you have no life and you can't say shit cause you know it's true so stop hating and why not you get a damn chance and grow up cause no one likes dickheads that's our just a no life so please be more mature you dick and don't judge a book by its cover what the hell I don't try to be a smart ass, and especially not a tough guy. And really, you think I'm lucky enough to pay my bills with YouTube money? No, I'm not on that same level as PewDiePie. I can't do that. You know, I wish I could, but that's not really a, a choice at the moment. And telling me to grow up is the biggest insult of all. I mean, look at your spelling and grammar skills. They're just... They, they make me lose hope for humanity. And that's all I'm going to say to you, Alan P Pr Prime. But about I f myself video, motherfucker. No idea what that means. I'm glad in your right, show your false fucker. I think he meant to say face and no to that. What we learned today is that PewDiePie is awesome and you suck shit. Not really sure you came to that conclusion, but whatever. Three words, you suck asshole. That is five words. I don't know, four words and a number, technically. Two words, don't hate. Three words. How about no? He is just doing what he loves, so leave him alone, lol. That exact same logic could apply to the very reason that I made the video, so f you. Um, I'm a bro, but why do they all say why do they all have to justify and say, I'm a bro, but I don't care. If you I don't give a shit if you're a bro. Whatever. Please don't call us stupid idiotic f you. Not reading the rest, f you. He's not doing it for fun, not to become famous. He may act dumb as well. Mm-hmm. Okay, yeah. Mm-hmm. Keep going. Mm-hmm. Okay, dude, if you hate something that keeps it to your effing self, no one needs to know. Sure, it's your opinion, but no one needs to know, okay? By that logic, I don't need to know that you think that. Nothing would ever work in the world if that logic was applied to simple everyday things. That is just so stupid. I understand he has very strong and violent fans, but there's no reason to call them out. For a start, I wouldn't call them strong. I would call them cowards and weaklings. But that's just my opinion, but there's no reason to call them out. The whole point was to call them out. Why, why should we have to sit there and just accept that there are these ten-year-olds who just attack people who criticize something they like? I'm sorry, that's just not how the world works. Sir, he is very funny in his own way. Blah, 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 blah. I said in the video specifically, I don't care if you like him. What I don't like about him is the way his fans will go and attack people who don't like him. And there's nothing wrong with not liking him. So onto the spelling and grammar morons now. Jesus, this is going long, but I actually had a fake PewDiePie account come on and say, you're just a big f and hater. So I went on his uh, YouTube account to see, you know, what his, what his channel is. And it's just it's just a fake account where he, he re-uploads PewDiePie videos. What the f***? The f*** sort of sh** is that? He needs criticising me. F*** you. How does it feel that 14 million people hate you, bitch? That is just so ludicrous. <laughs> it's funny how mindless these people are. They, they think that they are part of an army. A keyboard warrior army. That just sit around attacking people who don't like him. Like, what the f***? So the wonderful hydrocortidum. Sorry if I said your said your name, but but you pointed out all the all the all the truths. So he basically says there's a the uh, typical sort of PewDiePie drone follows a certain set of rules. So they all have zero knowledge of grammar, punctuation, and spelling. Yep, check. They all seem the same as most of the COD fan base. So the homophobic, illogical ten-year-olds who say they slept with your mum and I, I tell you to kill yourself and that lot. And they assume anyone who wasn't a fan is jealous. Spot on. And they believe a subscriber count is directly proportional to the quality of someone's videos. Ex exactly. This is it. I didn't even need to make this whole video. I could have just read this comment out. Done. But I'm going to keep going though. So this guy quit for f**k's sake, I'm guessing that's what it means. Dude, you're so f**k stupid. My apolog apologies to your mum. There we go, people. Well, that sums it up right there. He, 
He just proved the point by replying to the comment with just the most stupid thing imaginable. Then he goes on to, get to reply to someone else saying, Oh, look at you trying to get some attention. I'm opening my care box. Oh, wait, it's empty. You didn't prove any point, attention whore. And there we go again. There we go again. Yep, yep. Hydrocortoderm was, was exactly right. They always, always fit into one of those subsections of a just, just f***ing idiot. You like your comedy and we like out comedy. Okay, by that, by that reasoning, why did you come to my video and feel like you had to, you know, describe that to me, to explain that to me? Okay, you like it. Why? I don't care. Go and watch it if it's so good. You know, go away. So finally, we move on to the threats and insults. There aren't very many threats, thank God. You don't actually want to be killed because of a f***ing stupid YouTube video, but yeah, f*** you. From Tyler Williams, which is obviously his real name which is the new thing YouTube do where they try and make you to use your real name. So this uh, kid, and I know he's a kid because I went on his channel and I had a look. And it is, it's so inappropriate. He's got all these videos that are all just so badly spelt as well and everything, where he's just sat there shirtless usually, sometimes with his little, his like even younger sister. He must be about nine, eight, ten years old. He looks so young. And he's got his... his even younger sister in there as well and they're just it's so inappropriate as i went on his video and commented saying your, your parents are bad people your parents are bad people for letting you do this because one day you're going to look back in this and think you know what was i thinking what, what an absolutely stupid thing to do especially going around just insulting people as well jesus christ kid if somebody makes a video again like this please email me your address because i will go there bro fist you in the face using a chair, let ducks help me to kill you and then put your dead body in a barrel and push you deep river onto a cliff. I know that's a bunch of sort of references to things that PewDiePie does in his videos, but this just really is the icing on the cake. It shows how just young and immature they are. That That is... Ugh. So I just realised I put one from Slenderman again in here. F*** you little shit. I don't give a f Whatever. I'm not going to read the rest. You can read it. I'll put it on screen. It Yep, proving my point again. F*** you. Then why did you make the video retard? Why did you come to my video and comment that? I'm just... I'm just losing all hope. Right now. F*** you, you're just gay, faggot. Jealous of him, what a shame. Yep, there's another one. Get the list out and tick... It's off. <laughs> You f***ing British bitch, and it's not too that I don't f***ing care. Right now, I'm I'm convulsing. I, f I feel like I'm about to retch. My eyes feel like they could fall out any second. My nose is bleeding. I feel like I could I could breathe fire right now. That is it. I, I am I'm done. I'm done with these people. I'm. As soon as they comment, I'm just gonna just delete them. I'm. That is it. <laughs> I can't do this anymore. So that's it. That's all the people I care to to even mention. Giving them... I almost wish I didn't do this now just to not give them the attention, but whatever. So closing point. These people, PewDiePie fans, are fine. It's just the specific people that uh, were pointed out in the in the list. You know what? I'm going to make a poster now. I'm going to make a poster with the uh, PewDiePie rabid fanboy 10 year old list of rules of things they fit into poster thing. And it's going to have all those three things on so then everyone can, can buy a copy and put it on their wall and when they get a, a reply to a comment somewhere on the internet they can go, oh wait, let's have a look. Can he spell? Oh no, no, he must be in, yep, he fits perfectly into there. So, Jesus. God, I feel like it's... Ugh, bye.